A port here on business is closed tonight after a vehicle crashed through the restaurant on Sunday. For the family who owns the business, this isn't the first tragedy they've had to deal with. Our Luke Lester caught up with the family at McCormick's restaurant in Port Huron as they face their next challenge. Jason McCormick says the crash is a minor setback and that this kind of adversity is something that this family has dealt with before. And if there's a will, there's a way. Um, everything basically in this world happens for a reason. Sunday morning, McCormick's Bar and Restaurant was hit by a vehicle that flew through the dining area, destroying everything in its path. This is what day-to-day -day operator Jason McCormick and the owner, Jason's mother, Sheila, are faced with for the cleanup. Jason recalls the night he received a call from his friend saying he should go check out the bar. Got here, you know, the first initial instinct is hopefully that person that, you know, was in the accident, hopefully everybody's okay. Fortunately, nobody was inside the building and there were no injuries as a result of the crash. As cleanup begins, Jason can't help but to think of his father, Robert. Robert McCormick passed away on August 18th of 2022 in a car crash. August 18th also happens to be Jason's birthday. McCormick's was Robert pursuing a dream, a dream cut short, one that Jason and Sheila are continuing to honor their family's legacy. He's always going to be a part of us here, um, and like I said, he, it's meant a lot to me. And through the destruction that was this unfortunate accident, Jason snapped this photo on the night it happened, a photo that stayed in place behind what was the bar of his father, Robert. It, it just it gives him the credit that it you know, he deserved, um, no matter what is all thrown at us, he, he stood strong for all of us. Reporting in Port Huron, Luke Lasser, CBS News, Detroit.